Alex Geyser. And I'm Olivia Jatowski. We're student researchers with Marine Fisheries and we're out here today on Potter Pond talking about clinging jellyfish and how you can stay safe this summer. Clinging jellyfish are very small, about the size of a dime, but can have a powerful sting. Because they are so small, they are difficult to see and avoid, so it is important to take precautions when enjoying the coastal ponds this summer. Clinging jellyfish are found in calm, protected waters such as Potter Pond, Point Judith Pond, Narrow River, and Ninigrit Pond. They typically show up in June and will remain throughout the summer until their life cycle ends in the early fall. During the day, they attach to submerged vegetation such as eelgrass. To reduce the risk of being stung, cover up with waders, a wet suit, or rash guard. Or stick to sandy or surfy areas away from clinging jellyfish habitat. It's a good idea to have some first aid supplies in case of a sting. There are jellyfish sting sprays that you can buy or rinsing with vinegar also works well. You can also use a hot compress or an ice pack. If near a sink, you can also rinse the affected area in hot water, as hot as one can handle without being burned. Do not rinse the sting with cool, fresh water or urinate on it. This can actually make the sting worse. If symptoms worsen, seek medical attention immediately. DEM encourages people to enjoy our coastal ponds this summer and all the activities we love like swimming, shell fishing, boating. Just remember these simple safety precautions, you can have a happy, healthy summer.